Today we're going to be taking a look at a Gitter Crucible multi-purpose pocket knife and that's coming up next year on Jesse V Outdoors. Welcome back everybody and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Leave a comment down below if you like videos like this. So what we got here is a Gritter pocket knife here. I'd like to thank Gritter for sending this out to the channel for us to try out. What we're going to do is, is we're going to take it over to the table here. I'm going to tell you some of the specs about it. Then we're probably going to take it outside and use it and we'll see how it cuts paper. So let's go ahead and get started. This is a tactical EDC multi-function knife. This is perfect for camping, hiking, fishing, and other outdoor activities. The blade is made from a high carbon 8ZR13 MOV stainless steel. It offers great excellent hardness, a great edge retention, improved wear resistance, enhanced corrosion resistance, and it's easy to sharpen. The tantal blade works well for an everyday use. It is partially serrated to cut through ropes and fibrous materials. The Black G10 Grips delivers a non-slip grip, giving you control, agility, and comfort. The liner lock prevents accidental closing and also secures the blade when closed. The finger flipper and the ambi thumb knobs provide for quick one-handed opening. It has quick and easy access with a pocket clip. It features a seat belt cutter and a glass breaker, making this knife great for survival, emergencies, and accident situations. The total length of the knife is 8 inches, and then the blade is a total length of 3 inches. Weighs in at 4.8 ounces, and it comes with a lifetime warranty. Now we got a piece of paper here, and I want to test out the sharpness of this knife. And you can just go ahead and pop this right through the paper here, just like this. And you can see it cuts it with absolutely no problem. I love it when this happens just like that. Very decently sharp blade for being in this price range right off the bat. That's real nice. Now let's go take it outside and do something outside with it. Now that we're outside, I want to try a couple things here. I want to try the thumb stud again. We can see that opens up just fine. Flip it open again. Really like that. Really nice, easy to open. Now let's try the flipper part because that one on this might be a little bit difficult. You can see right there, you can flip it. That time it worked, but you got to do it pretty hard to get it to come out. If you flick your wrist, it comes out a lot better. But it don't seem like it has a lot of force behind it. I'd like to see a little bit more force behind that one. So let's move on to the next test. Now the next test I like doing is I got a stick here. And I like just to see how much shavings it takes off. If it takes off a lot, we can see here it's really digging into there. That's one thing I like because I like to see if it could whittle a stick. In survival situations, you never know where you might need wood shavings to start a fire. Or you might need to make a point with something. And this is definitely taking chunks out of that wood. So on this part, I think it's doing pretty good. You can see there when I get up into a new piece I haven't done yet, it flies everywhere. That is really nice about that. And that's one thing I look for in a good EDC knife. So the next thing I want to test out on this blade is going to be the straighted part. What we got here is some paracord. And the thing about paracord is a lot of people know in a survival situation, you can use paracord in so many different ways. So I just want to slide this over to the serrated part here real quick. Get it right on the center there and see how easy it is to pull and break right through that paracord. That is real nice that it'll cut through that that easy. This is the thing that I really look for also in a survival knife and I like that. So as you guys can see, I only demonstrated a couple things that the Gritter Crucible can do. But this is a multifunctional tool and you gotta love that if you're hiking, camping, or if you do anything outdoors, it's great to have a knife like this. So once again, I'd like to thank Gritter for sending this out to the channel for us to try out. As always, I'll keep using this and if I have any issues with it, I'll get back with you guys and let you know. So don't forget to check the links out down below. I'll have a link down there for this for you guys to check out. They also have a bunch of camping gear. They have holsters and a bunch of other things. I do have a review coming up on one of their holsters. They have a lot of great products for the outdoors, so check that link out and try to pick you up something if you need it. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Leave a comment down below if you like videos like this. We are One Nation Under God, and I'll see you all on the next one.